China has done it again. The Chang'e 6 mission has successfully landed on the far side of the moon. Let's explore this significant achievement. On June 2nd, at 6.23 a.m. Beijing time, the Chang'e 6 probe touched down inside Apollo Crater. This is in the South Pole Aitken Basin, one of the largest impact craters in the solar system. This marks China's second successful landing on the moon's far side. The first was Chang'e 4 in January 2019. No other country has landed on the far side even once. The far side of the moon always faces away from Earth. This makes communication with robots there very difficult. China solved this by launching special relay satellites. The Kuaikiao 2 satellite helped Chang'e 6 land safely. After launching on May 3rd, Chang'e 6 spent weeks preparing for the landing. Now, the lander will collect about 4.4 pounds of lunar dirt and rock. Some samples will come from the surface and some from up to 6.5 feet underground. These samples will be sent back to Earth, arriving on June 25th. Scientists will study them to learn more about the moon's history and why the far side is so different from the near side. China's Chang'e program has been exploring the moon for 17 years. From orbiters to landers and rovers, each mission has been more complex and ambitious. And there's more to come. Chang'e 7 will explore the moon's south pole in 2026. Chang'e 8 will test new technologies there in 2028. These missions will pave the way for crewed lunar missions by 2030. China aims to build an astronaut outpost near the moon's south pole in the 2030s. They will work with partners like Russia, Belarus, and Pakistan. The United States has similar plans with its Artemis program, aiming for a crewed lunar landing by late 2026. Over 40 nations have joined the Artemis Accords to explore the moon together. China's Chang'e 6 mission is a giant leap in lunar exploration. It brings us closer to understanding our moon and sets the stage for future missions. Stay tuned for more exciting updates from space.